Sandra here from Creating Spain and today I've got Scar for Open Shortcuts Lot 4 and I'm going to show you what happens when you use the wrapper tool under this menu. I've just got some uh, writing here, I thought it was quite appropriate because wrapper tools are often used for doing vinyl designs on mugs and things. And if I select this, oops, there we go. Uh, go up to the effects and then choose wrapper. You can see what happens. Under the settings, you have different measurements that you can put in. Top diameter is on there at the moment, but if you click on it, you can put in the top radius or the top circumference, depending on which measurement you can more easily get your mitts on. Again, with the bottom diameter and then the slant height or the vertical height and you can plug in these measurements according to whatever that you, know, you want to put your design on. If you have the add template ticked then you will get this um, template basically shape template around your design if you check that you will have it if you have it unchecked then when you've completed that will disappear. You can alter the offset. So, for example, you can move the writing to the left or right, and you can move it up and down as well. There we go. And you can also choose the scale, so you can make it bigger if you want or make it smaller. So, if that was the actual size of your mug or your glass, you'd probably want it about that size. You can have the auto preview checked and then you click OK and there it is. And if you go to the preview here you'll see that the cut lines are around the template as well as being on the bit that you actually designed. It's really handy and it's a very good thing to have if you're doing lots of mugs, glassware, that sort of thing. It just saves you getting the design wrong basically and it allows you to place things very carefully where you should be placing them rather than find you've cut something out and then it's not where it ought to be. Okay, thanks very much for watching. Bye bye.